next method under analytical method it's the trigonometric method in here we will be dealing with the triangle so um, there are two methods in here so first is the figure is a right triangle so let's have here the resultant on how we um, solve for the resultant so let's have the formula resultant is equivalent to square root of a squared plus b squared this is familiar to you this is the Pythagorean theorem and also the direction of the uh, resultant which is the angle or the theta is equivalent to tan raised to negative 1 b all over a so let's apply this one let's have here an example so vector a and vector b for us to know if this uh these vectors have a figure of a right triangle so let's illustrate so let's have figure uh, let's have vector a as a six kilometers due west and b as a five kilometers due north so let's illustrate so for a six kilometers due west so let's have here so west so this is our vector a next five kilometers due north so patasha so for example this is our vector b so let's have the polygon method so head to tail so let's connect this one so this is our resultant and our angle of or direction of our resultant is this is uh, obviously we can have the um, direction as a no, um, north of west or west papuntang north so let's apply this one so let's solve for the resultant let's substitute the square root of a squared plus b squared so a squared so west so let's consider always consider since west or papuntang west or papuntang negative x axis so we will consider the sign so negative six kilometers squared plus five kilometers squared so in the north is positive diba? it lies in the positive y axis so the answer must be 7.81 kilometers so this is our result next would be our angle or direction of our resultant so let's have the tan raised to negative 1 b all over a our b is 5 kilometers all over 6 kilometers so our angle must have 39.81 degrees so there so let's consider our resultant so 7.81 kilometers 39 Point eighty one degrees. What is our direction? Due north of west. So this is our final result for this example. Next is our um, next method is figure is not a right triangle. So in here we will be using the formula for resultant r squared is equal equivalent to a squared plus b squared plus 2ab cos d theta or r squared is equivalent to a squared plus b squared minus 2ab cos 180 minus d theta or the angle so these are the uh, this is the formula for cosine law next for our direction of resultant so this is our sine law so Theta is equivalent to sine raised to negative 1 times b, of, uh, b times sine 180 degrees minus the alpha divided by the resultant that you will be solving. So, the, so let's apply this one with our um, uh, example. So let's have here vector A and vector B. So for us to know if this figure is not a right triangle, let's illustrate. So, let's have 6 kilometers due west. So, let's illustrate here. So, due west. So, let's have, this is the vector A, for example. Then, vector V, northwest. If we say northwest, it has a 45 degree angle. So, let's consider, for example, this is the 45 degree. So, there. So, here. This is our vector B. For us to know the resultant, so let's uh, 
have the polygon method so let's connect the head to head and tail of uh, of this a and b vector so this is our resultant and our angle would be here always i will just emphasize the angle always the angle of the resultant or the direct direction of the resultant must lie on the x axis so let's try to solve so we figure out that we, this is not a right triangle so we will be using the cosine and the sine law for the resultant and the angle or the direction of the resultant respectively so let's apply so let's have the resultant so since there is squared there so we can have the square root so that makansal yung ating squared sa resultant so let's have a squared so what is our a six kilometers squared so let's consider since pa west siya, let's consider the side plus five kilometers squared plus two times so let's have two times six times five cos what is our angle it's 45 degrees so there so the resultant must i must be 10.17 kilometers so there next how about the angle in angle so i will just um remove here para makasolve tayo let's try solve the angle the direction of resultant so sine raised to negative one let's have left uh vector b five and the sine 180 degrees minus the alpha which is the 45 degrees divided by the resultant that we had solved a while ago so 1017 so there so the theta or the angle that you will be solving must have 20.34 degrees so for our final resultant for our final resultant you must get 10.17 kilometers 20.34 degrees what is the direction so obviously here we can have north of west so there you 